The month-long Caracal slave revolt of 1795 was led by a slave named Tula. He worked as a slave in a Dutch colony called Caracal, which is located about 37 miles north of Venezuela's coastline. The revolt began at the Nip Plantation, which was owned by Caspar Ludwig van Utrecht at Van de Boe. It began on the morning of August 17, 1795, and was carried out by Tula and about 50 other slaves. These slaves came together and informed their master that they wanted to be paid and that they would no longer live in bondage. They then traveled to several plantations to gather more men for the rebellion, beginning with Legume. While at Legume, Tula and his men went to the jail and helped 22 slaves escape. The rebels went to Santa Cruz, where Bastian Caparta led this group of slaves. The governor started to prepare his own militia to fight against the slave rebels after the son of Caspar Utrecht delivered a letter by horseback informing him about the rebellion. While Tula continued his raids, a Confederate French slave named Luis Mercier led his own group of slave rebels. Under Mercier's command, 10 mixed race soldiers, as well as their commander, Van de Grip, were taken as prisoners. Mercier also freed more slaves at the Nip Plantation. Governor Joannes de Vere understood that the slaves meant business. He called on the 77 Navy seamen on the Medea ship to subdue the rebels. On August 19th, Lieutenant R.G. Pleasure and his men met with Tula and his men at their camping ground in Port Tamari. Unfortunately for Pleasure, he and his men were defeated. Pedro Wakio started another rebellion on his plantation. He gathered weapons and killed his master named Sable. A priest named Jacob Schink was used by Governor Jonas de Vere to negotiate with Tula and his men. Tula would not settle for anything less than freedom. After two failed negotiations, the priest ordered the Dutch military to kill any slave holding a firearm. Ultimately, Tula won his battle. He carried on with this rebellion and was merciless against his enemies. Tula and other rebels poisoned whales and stole food in order to survive. Sadly, Tula and his men were betrayed by another slave. After being captured, Tula and his men, Luis Mercier, Bastian Caparta, Pedro Wakio, and other slave rebels were tortured to death and died on October 3, 1795. There is a monument of Tula on the south coast of Caracal.